Yo, what's up guys, it's Epic Legend. Today I want to show you guys how to import videos into Share Factory. I hope you guys could drop a like, subscribe, and let's get right into this video. So, for an example, let's say I want to use a video clip right here. So let's say I want to choose this one here to um, import into Share Factory. All I would do is um, copy the URL and then head over to YouTube to MP3 converter. So once you go here, all you guys need to do is make sure that it's in MP4 format and then paste the URL and click convert. So once it's done converting, all you simply need to do is click download. So once you have your USB plugged into your computer and the video you want to import downloaded, all you need to do is add a new folder onto your USB and title it Share Factory. Make sure you guys that there are no spaces in it because that could mess it up. So once you guys make that folder, you guys will need to go into that folder and make another folder within the folder and title one videos, another one music, and an the last one images. So, once you have your folders set up, you could then go to add your video. So, you guys could go into your downloads and look for the video you want to import. And you simply drag it over to the USB and drag it into the Share Factory folder, then drag it into the videos folder. So, you could then eject your USB, plug it into your PS4, and get ready to import it into Share Factory. So, once you're in Share Factory, you'd head over to Import Content, and then go to Import Videos. So, once you click on that, it show you this page. So, I already imported the video that I wanted to convert, but I'll show you guys what you guys would do. So you guys would then head over to import from USB, click X, and wait till it finishes loading the video clips, and it will show the files on your USB, and then it would show the videos here. So you would simply select the video, then click square to import it. So on this page, it will show your imported videos here, and you guys can make sure that it is imported. So once you guys have your video imported, you guys could go ahead and start a new project and choose your imported video so your video would show up just like where all the rest of your videos are and you can select that and start your project so as you guys can see here my video that I got from YouTube is here in my project and imported alright guys this is the end of the video I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope it helps you guys and hit that like and subscribe button so you guys don't miss out and see you guys on the next tutorial